hello guys welcome back to my channel it's me tt and we have a review today of the new main choice line that just dropped it is called the pow collection so if you're interested in that then stay tuned Like I said, we're going to be talking about the new collection that the main choice just dropped um, called the Power Collection. So, first of all, let me just start off by saying that when I saw the line on their Instagram page, I didn't think it was like a real thing just because of how the packaging looks. Um, I did think that it was like an April Fool's type of thing. So my bad and just offer it first impression of the product is um the packaging is it's different it's unique it's cool like i said i didn't really think that it was um a real thing when, um so let's get into the individual products um of course starting with the shampoo um everything smells the same it has a very fruity like maybe grape kool-aid <laughs> type smell it definitely smells purple if that makes any sense uh it lathers really well for some reason i use too much shampoo i usually don't use a lot because i do shampoo twice i did for my first shampoo, it ended up using a whole lot. I don't know why. I have no idea why. But the lather was amazing. It was a nice, thick, cleansing lather. The conditioner is nice and thick. Um, had a little bit of trouble getting it out of the bottle, which is how thick it was. Which is kind of how I'm used to uh, the main choices conditioners. I'm used to them being thick meaning that I don't have to use a lot and um, the stretch of it, it spreads really, really well. Uh, this particular conditioner made detangling like super crazy easy. So I really like the conditioner. Uh, the next product that I use is the mask. Uh, the mask is probably thicker than the conditioner which is not a bad thing um both of the products feel very smooth so they're thick but they're smooth and they're going easy and they have a nice spread to them so you don't have to use a lot um like i said everything smells the same what i did like about this mask is it I could feel it like coating my strands like as I put it in and I you know started to rub it in I could feel it moving getting to all of my hair so uh, the next product I use would be the leave-in conditioner um the leave-in conditioner is thick but it's not too thick which is pretty cool um it has a great spread just like the rest of the products again i didn't need to use a lot so the products that we all want to know about is the gel um first impressions on the gel um literally my mind went hmm it's watery <laughs> it's kind of watery um i did have the ancient egyptian line it's uh purple and gold um it kind of this gel kind of puts me in the mind of that gel as far as how it looks i believe that that gel might be a bit um thicker and consistent consistency so it's not you know you shake your jar it's not moving around i'm not saying that there's anything wrong with that in this gel or in any gel I'm just not used to buying the gel that is like, you know, so loose. Let me retract my statement because that's not true. The first gel that I bought from the main choice with the purple and black labeling packaging, that gel was pretty loose. Um, 
But with all of that being said, it is still a great gel. It did great at defining my curls. The, the best thing about this line is that I don't have to use a lot of it to get definition or to feel the products. Like even now, this is, um, I just unraveled my twist today, my flat twist today. Um, I, I didn't have to use a lot of the product to feel the product. Um, like touching my hair, my hair is thoroughly moisturized, so I'm good um downfall about this gel though is the glitter like there's a lot of glitter i got my products on ultabeauty.com i'll put the link in the description box i spent uh 79.85 or something you put the tax on it then you know it's gonna jump to either 80 or 81 whatever as far as my hair goes with this style the products aren't giving me the stretch that I like. I actually did band my hair for probably about an hour, maybe a little under, because it just wasn't. It, um, the definition is good. I do like the definition. I actually love the definition. Um, even in the back where I usually have problems and I, it's just, it's kind of stiff. And I didn't use a lot of products, but I did use everything. So maybe that's it. Maybe if I take the conditioner out and just do the mask, um, then it might be okay. Because my hair does feel really, really moisturized, which is nothing wrong with that. You always want your hair to be nice and moisturized, but it's just, it's stiff. Um, overall, I give these products a 6 out of 10. I'll give it a 6 out of 10. Um, huge deciding factor is obviously, because I keep saying it, the smell and the glitter and the gel. That's it. Um, but I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, if you have any input, please include it in the comments and I will talk back to you guys. We can start a conversation about it or whatever. Whatever y'all want to do, however y'all want to do it, we can get it done, okay? Don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my channel and check out any of the other videos that I have. I really look forward to seeing you guys on my next video. Thank you. Bye.